what's going on guys Mark is are here with another video and today is Wednesday April 15th and I just want to give you guys some exciting news the good news is that we're on the IRS official website so make sure you go to the official one irs.gov and make sure it's legit which it should be make sure it don't look fishy so with all that said and handled and out the way all you need to do is click on get info on economic impact payments and the reason why I want to show you this because as you guys can see here the get your payment get my payment button in blue is highlighted which means it's officially here right the IRS was saying Friday but it looks like they was able to speed up the process and they was able to get it out to the public two days earlier and this is important because you want to be able to provide the IRS your bank account information so they can do a direct deposit instead of you waiting for weeks and months for a check that you will receive, but who knows when you will receive it, right? So that's why you want to provide the IRS your bank account information. So just hit get my payment. And as you guys can see here, it's already due to high demand. A lot of people is already doing this as well. But I want to tell you guys so you guys get a head start on this before it just crashes and just gets overwhelmed by high demand, right? So we're just going to wait a few moments here. Don't take too long to get into this. I already done it myself. I updated my bank information again just to be on the safe side. If you guys haven't seen my first video, I made a first video on me doing this process, but I'm doing it again just to be on the safe side because like I said, I really want my money. And I need it, right? So with that said, just let this load up a little bit longer and then we'll get into it. Guys, so we're back after waiting about a minute and a half. I finally was able to get through to the system. So when you finally get through, you're gonna see this um, information right here from the government. Um, just read over it. Once you read over it, just hit okay. And then just enter your information here, um, your socials, date of birth, street address, and zip code so you got to get your street address correct so the irs might have your old address so if you don't so if you use your new address and you have issues not being able to continue then use your prior address so that might that should work and solve out the issue so let me go ahead and fill out my information here and the reason why i'm telling you this because i did it myself and the first time I used my new address, but it didn't work. So I used my old address and it worked. So just to give you guys a heads up there. So just filling this stuff out quickly. And let's see what it looks like now because I already entered my um, bank information before I made a video just to see how, just to see what everything looks like. Okay, so I'm almost done here. Okay, perfect. So I got everything filled out. I'm going to hit continue. And it just pretty much says payment status. You are eligible for the payment, which is good. That's good news. I definitely wanted to see that. I already knew I was eligible already, but it says you are eligible for the payment. Once we have your payment date, we will update this page. We will deposit your payment to the bank account information below the information that I provided. Updates to your payment are made no more than once a day. We will mail you a letter with additional information on this payment and so on. So pretty much I'm, I'm done. But if you're if this is the first time you're entering this, just follow the steps. And all it's just going to ask you is your pretty much your bank account information. And then once you completed that, I recommend you go back in, log back in, just to, just to see that you don't have any errors or that just to make sure that, you know, you are eligible, which I am. So with that said, wasn't trying to make this video too long. Just want to give you guys an update. So go ahead and go to the IRS website and follow the steps that you see in this video. So you can see, so you can update your payment information if the IRS already got your stuff information on file is just going to give you the um the date that your deposit is supposed to happen so marcus are give this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel if you haven't already i'm out guys